Since the start of the holy month of Ramadan, volunteers from various universities in Magdishu have been camping here to prepare and distribute food for internally displaced persons to break their fast. They have been doing this for the past five years. We provide iftar to about 400 to 600 poor and needy people every day. We take the prepared food packages to IDP camps and streets for distribution. I started this program in 2018. I am happy and delighted and hopefully will continue doing this all my life. The initiative is financially supported by generous contributions from well-wishers, mainly from the Somali diaspora community in Europe. We get most of the financial support from our Somali diaspora community, mainly based in Norway and other parts of the world, including even here in Mogadishu, and that is how this noble program is possible and done here. Some of the beneficiaries of the project say the support they receive will go a long way in helping them perform their religious obligation of fasting during the holy month. We appreciate the young people for providing iftar. It is generous and we receive it on time. We thank the Almighty and appreciate them for their generosity. With every passing day, the end of the holy month of Ramadan gets ever closer. This team of volunteers will be here preparing food for the poor for the remaining days. However, it is unclear just how the needy people will continue getting such support once the holy month ends. This iftar project might not meet all the needs of the poor people in Magdishu, but many people agree that it has transformed lives of the many of the beneficiaries.